Hello everyone, this is Apostle Anthony and Pastor Shelly here from Faith 5. And we want to thank those of you who listen to us and receive. Yeah, we thank you for your input because we know that we're doing this really to help you grow in your spiritual journey. That's right. So we've been talking about the whole aspect of denying yourself, yeah. picking up your cross, yeah. and following Jesus. Yeah. In order to do that, there are steps, there are processes, there are development. You don't yeah. just do something overnight like this. That's and right. so we've been talking about denying yourself and what denying yourself looks like. Mm -hmm. And why do I need to deny myself in order for me to pick up my cross and follow Jesus? That's right. So shall well, we help us here? The thing is that we're really concerned about our spirit growth, right? Mm -hmm. And so we have been talking, as yes. we were just talking again earlier this morning, and I think it was yesterday we were just saying, but mm -hmm. if it's our spirit, man, what spiritual food do we need to eat mm -hmm. as we're denying ourselves? Mm -hmm. And it was so interesting as we started to list the different right. things. It's just so much, mm -hmm. right? But denying ourselves is what is going to make room for our spirit man to grow. Mm -hmm. And in Colossians chapter 2, I, I, think, I think we did read this before, Colossians but I wanted to read it again. Sure. Colossians 2, mm -hmm. verse 6 and 7 says, And now just as you accepted Christ Jesus mm -hmm. as your Lord, mm -hmm. you must continue to follow him. Deny yourself. Mm -hmm. Take up a cross and follow him. Mm -hmm. So how you accepted him, you've got to keep on mm -hmm. doing it. Let your roots grow down into him. Into Christ. That's right. right. And let your lives be built on him. On Christ. It's all about him. You see, so we have to deny ourselves. Mm -hmm. If we're going to embrace him, mm -hmm. there's a denial. And then your faith will grow strong in the truth. Mm -hmm. Jesus is truth. Mm -hmm. In the truth you were taught and you will overflow with thankfulness. Mm -hmm. We can continue. Mm -hmm. And so I'm just going to list a couple of the things that we need, what our spiritual diet is. Mm -hmm. And we use the word diet. A lot of diets are out there. The ketogenic diet. Mm -hmm. I mean, if you want to lose weight. The, the ketogenic one is a big one these days, right? Mm -hmm. And so we are used to diets for a natural man. Mm -hmm. But if we're going to grow in our spirit, and our spirit growing means our spirit maturing. That's right. Is that right? That's right. And so I'm just going to list a couple of things I think we really need to be mindful of. Now, your revelation mm -hmm. of the word of God your revelation of the word of God mm -hmm. is what he's going to give you mm -hmm. is going to help you to grow. Mm -hmm. Now you're saying my revelations. I mean, there are different revelations. No, there's not. But as you are spending time with the Lord, you're reading the word. Mm -hmm. The word is important. Part mm -hmm. of your diet. You are praying. Pray without ceasing. Mm -hmm. Correct? Yes. Pray without ceasing. Worshipping. Mm -hmm. You got to worship the Lord. Mm -hmm. Rejoice in the Lord. Right. In everything you're going to give thanks. Everything, yes. Mm -hmm. Remember, you're in Christ and you're trying to set your roots down. you got to spend time with him. One of my favorites is Joshua 1 verse 8. You know, meditating. Meditating. Mm -hmm. You've got to meditate on the Lord day and night. Do you think mm -hmm. I should read that scripture? No, no, before you... It's so important for us to understand. Can yeah. You? For you to understand that your natural man does not want the diet of your spirit man. Oi. I want you to understand that it is one thing your diet, your, your natural man doesn't mind a little time hearing a preaching or going to church or getting some promises and blessings. But your spirit man does not eat the same food as your natural man. So when I got saved, mm -hmm. my natural appetite for the things of God opened, but it wasn't as full as the natural man, because the natural man, I've been feeding him all of my life. That's and so right. for me to grow in the spirit, yes, yes. rooted in Christ, I yes, grow yes. till I become thankful. Yes. One of the evidence of a growing believer is his thankfulness increases. Yeah, he's more aware, right? But my diet indicates that. Yeah. And so my diet, as, as, as Cheryl says, you're going to be thankful. Mm -hmm. You're going to spend mm -hmm. more time meditating. Yeah. More, more time in the Word yeah. and the Word yeah. of God for you. Yeah. Isn't just revelation. Yeah. It's the one you take in. Ah. 
So it doesn't matter what revelation that you get is the one that I take in. And eat. And, and eat. You know, and like absorb into my system. It in. Okay, okay. And bring it back out. Okay. okay. So that's not what well, what's binding, what's in, what's for the old testament, what's new testament, mm -hmm. what is for the Jew, what is past, whatever you take from God speaking to you, yeah. No one can tell you it's not yours. I that's it. As because, as, do you understand what I'm saying? That's Bradley? it. As what many you, as received him, right. to them he gave power to become sons of that's God. Right. And so the thing is, I now have a spiritual DNA in me, mm -hmm. and I now can become the son of God. What I take in, as you said, what mm -hmm. I take in. What I take in is yes. mine, and no teacher on the planet. Yes. Apart from the Holy Spirit can tell you that I receive it in my spirit. That's correct. Well, that's for the Jew. Mm -hmm. That's for the Gentile. Mm -hmm. That's for that church. When God gives you spiritual food you and you digest it, it yes. like the Old Testament prophets, they took it in yes. and they brought it what God gave them. Yeah. So your dad is what God gives you. So what are you? What are you? So what's your dad? What you chewing on today? What's your diet like? Mm -hmm. Think about it because if you start looking at your diet, mm -hmm. there's things you're going to have to take out of your diet if you're going to deny yourself mm -hmm. and you want to grow spiritually, right? That's right. You want to just pray. Whoever you feel grows. Amen. So let's pray. Yes. Father, we want to thank you because right now I know my brothers and sisters are wondering. Yes. We are struggling, but we realize that you came, that we could be rooted in Christ and overcome us. Yes. We pray today, Father, yes. that the spirit of each person, hear my voice, will increase and our hunger for the things in that you gave us on our plate will increase. Bless our dad. Bless the spirits of those who are hearing me now. And they may grow in a deeper awareness of you and become those who make an impact in this world. We thank you, Father, in Jesus' name. Amen. Have a good week. Enjoy yourself. Bye.